Hey y'all, how y'all doing? Welcome or welcome back. So today I just wanted to bring you guys a quick makeup look and a hair review. This hair was sent to me by Julia Hair off of Amazon.com. It is their 14 inch water wave headband wig. This is the package it comes in. And they also included two headbands and wig caps. The total for this was after taxes and everything was about $91 and some change. Of course, free shipping. Once again, this is what the headbands look like. They sent me two of the same ones. And then the hair. I literally just got this. So pretty. So it is 14 inches like I said. Here's the headband part. It's kind of like the material that the bonnets are made out of. Here's the inside construction. There's three combs. There's two right here and then one in the front and then another comb in the back. And you get these Velcro straps to tighten the wig around. So, and it's just a natural hair color. It doesn't have a smell. That's good. Let's throw this baby on. Let's see. Ooh. Okay, this is a quick, <laughs> I gotta get to the store wig. Let me put one of these bobby pins in. All right. And I was reading on Amazon that the, like the, what is it called? Like the size of the wig is about 22.5. So, that's cool. I have a small head, so <laughs> every wig fits me, but it's always a little bit too big. I didn't use the back comb. I, ooh, that was quick. Okay, I just put the Velcro together. All right, I'm gonna lift this back behind my ears. Put this back a bit so I can have my baby hairs. Oh, that is quick, <laughs> all right looks natural looks like my own hair okay okay so let's wet this hair a bit well first let me put on one of these headbands and thank you Julia hair for sending me this I appreciate it I'm trying to look into this mirror so you can cover up the band and put your own little headbands that you want to rock with this. Oh, yes. <laughs> this is simple. Okay. Let's see. I don't want to have my fears. Let's see. I told you guys I have a small head, so it's a little bit big. Of course, like I said, you can adjust it, scoot back the actual headband that comes on the wig. And then do what you want. So I'm gonna go ahead and wet this hair. This is just water. Not getting any tangling, no shedding. Okay. <laughs> I love this. Do you guys see it? Let me make sure you guys are seeing these curls. This looks just like my natural hair. Oh, I love it. Ready. And I wanted the shorter length because I could have got it longer, but I wanted the shorter length because don't 
nobody got time for all that long, hot hair. Like, no. I wanted something that looked natural and like it's mine. Ooh, I got water flying everywhere. Sorry, y'all. What time is it? I think it's about 7.30 in the morning. Ooh. And I have to go to the grocery store really quickly right now to go get my stuff for my smoothies. Oh, so I'm keeping this on, honey. Add some water here. Oh my God. I love this. Like, I always, for years, been rocking headbands with my synthetic wigs and half wigs and stuff, but it's cool to have human hair, especially if you're going on vacation and you're trying to get in the water, but you don't want to have to have, worry about your lace, you know, lifting up or anything. Go ahead and throw this on, boo. Switch out your headbands. You be looking good. <laughs> Oh, I like this. <laughs> I'm so happy with this texture. Like, yes. So that was simple. <laughs> wow, wow, wow. And for $91, of course, the price goes up when you like get longer lengths and stuff, but for the 14 inches, like I said, it totaled out to $91 and some change. And I'll leave their links down below and the direct link to this hair and this length. Oh man, I like this. Okay, so let's go ahead and get into this makeup really quickly. I'm just gonna do a quick simple look because like I said, I'm just going to, um, I have a little bit of shedding. I'm just gonna go to the grocery store. So yeah, this is so pretty. Oh my God. Yes. I could have put a little bit of product in it, but I don't, I don't wanna do that. I like this. Okay, so for my eyes, we're keeping it simple. I'm just gonna go in with this orange shade from the Juvia's Place palette. Scoot in. And I already primed my eyes. I just used the Makeup Revolution Cut Crease Canvas. As usual, I don't use anything else unless it's just concealer, but yeah. Just putting this all over the lid. We're keeping this simple, honey. And that's the Juvia's Place Saharan Blush Volume 2 palette, if I'm not mistaken. I'll look at it after I put this on. But we're doing a one and done eyeshadow. And yes, you heard me right, the blush palette. You know you can use blush for eyeshadow, eyeshadows for blush, contour, anything. Do what you want. Let me just blend that out. Okay, so I have my lashes on. For my face, I wanted to use this Milk Makeup, what is it, cooling water. I have purchased it at Marshall's for $6.99. Whoa. I had it in the refrigerator, so it'll be really cold. So I'm supposed to just de-puff. Oh God, that feels good. Ooh. <laughs> that feels really, really good. Now you can use it on your neck too. Oh my gosh, that feels good. Okay, I got it for $6.99. That feels so good on my skin. 
So I'm not even gonna use any primer. I'm gonna go in with my foundation. I'm gonna use the Maybelline Dream Urban Cover and I'm in the shade 330, uh, what is it? 330 Toffee. And I'm just gonna put that on with my Shop Miss A foundation brush. stuff feels so good by milk makeup oh my goodness wow I don't know if it's deep puffing or how long I was supposed to wait but I just wanted to try it this is one of my favorite foundations it's so beautiful Lightweight and all. Absolutely gorgeous foundation. This is a very good everyday foundation, just like the Fit Me. But this is more like a tinted moisturizer type of foundation, like the feel of it. And this is buildable. But for me, since I'm not going for all that coverage, I'm just gonna leave it at this. Or y'all want to see it built up. Let me put on just a little bit more. And I love the smell of it. It smells like sunscreen. I love the smell of sunscreen. Just a little over my hyperpigmentation. And this side, it's just darker. Like, that's just how my skin gets darker on me like where my cheekbones are below my cheekbones. So it's always gonna look like a shadow. Oh, I love this. Such a beautiful foundation. Okay. So, oh, I don't want this dripping, so that in there. Highly, highly, highly recommend this foundation. For concealer, I'm going to use the e.l.f. Hydrating Camo Concealer, and I'm in the shade Medium Beige. Then I'm just gonna set that a little bit with this Maybelline, it's all scratched off, I've had this forever. Maybelline Shine Free Loose Powder and it's in 02 Medium. Whoa, that got everywhere. Oh my gosh. Take it on the back of my hand, y'all know I don't like a lot of powder. I just want enough to set it since it is a hydrating primer. 
primer, I mean not primer, hydrating concealer. Oh my gosh, that powder's everywhere. take my foundation brush go around the edges I didn't use a lot of powder so I can still mix liquids with the powder it's not going to end up looking blotchy okay warm up my face I'm going to use the essence matte bronzing palette go in with this shade right here. I'm my Sonia Kashuk brush. Y'all see how pigmented that is? $7.99, boo. $7.99 at Ulta. my headband dirty so I'm gonna just tread lightly around the perimeters I'm gonna come back and blend this out I just want to get the pigment down look at how pigmented that is <laughs> that's crazy My new favorite powder brush, this one by Eco Tools. I'm just blending that out. You see, diffusing that color so it's not so harsh. And like I told you guys at the beginning, this right here, that's my skin. <laughs> like, <laughs> that's just the shadow it naturally gives, so. Go back with whatever's left on this brush, and I'm just going to do my nose. And of course, that's my dog. Okay, for an all over face powder, going with my Sephora Micro Smooth. Ooh, 
love this and I have it in the shade tan yeah I'm gonna have to wash this headband these brushes are so smooth Wow Okay, I guess for a little bit of blush, we can do that. I'm gonna use the same brush I use my bronzer. I'm gonna go in with that orange shade, lightly, from the Juvia's Place palette. Okay, so I went ahead and just took a little bit of that orange blush and I put it on my cheeks and across my nose. Now I'm just gonna go in lightly with this Bretman Rock and Morphe um, palette. What is this called? Babe in Paradise. I'm gonna take this shade right here. Yes, it looks white, but it's actually pink, like an iridescent shade. I'm gonna go lightly, just right here, let me see. Like, oh, do you see that? I think this looks beautiful on deeper skin tones. I love it. So pretty, and I just went lightly, a little dab in there. little bit on my nose. Whoa, that was a lot. Let me put that on my cheek. Oh, I love that. Just a little on my nose. So I need eyeliner, bottom eyeliner, and mascara, and then my lips and set my face. Of course, for mascara, I'm gonna use the Tarte Big Ego Mascara, and for eyeliner, the Urban Decay Perversion. I need to sharpen this. And I'm not taking it all the way in. that for that mascara quickly I don't care what anyone says this is my favorite mascara Yes, I'm talking to you, Lala. <laughs> she hates this mascara. Okay. My bottom lashes are getting really long. Okay, this powder on my table is bugging me. For lips, I'm just going to... I'll do my favorite lip combo at the moment. It's the NYX Lip Liner in Downtown Beauty. And then I put on Dubai, the Soft Matte Lip Cream by NYX too. Love this. So after I put that on, I'll be right back to show you guys the finished look. And I also have to spray my face. I almost forgot to show you guys what this looks like from the back. So gorgeous, I love it. Okay, okay. When I tell you guys I love this lip combo, I mean, I truly love it. So pretty. These are so comfortable. So now, go ahead and set my face with the Morphe Continuous Setting Mist. And this is a completed look. 
Once again, I will leave all the details for this hair down below. Don't forget to check them out on Amazon. I love their hair. This was just a quick, simple, headed to the grocery store <laughs> makeup look. I hope everybody has a wonderful day. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe, and I'll see you guys next time. Bye.